Hello everybody, it's Mr. Sulik here, and I'm here to teach you today how to create a drum rhythm using an online in-browser application called OneMotion. It's at onemotion.com slash drum hyphen machine and the link will be in the description of this video. And I will show you today what you're going to be expected to, to do for your assignment. The first thing you'll see when you show up at the drum machine is a rhythm already entered into the application. Now if you can press play on the rhythm and it'll loop and loop. It's pretty cool but whatever shows up here we're gonna actually start a new a new project. So the way you're gonna do that is you're gonna go to the page icon click that click the first option new project are you sure you want to reset everything click OK now it's blank now if you want to know what one of the drums sounds like let's look at the kick drum right here it's the whole list of drums we're gonna start with the kick drum you're gonna click on the volume slider here and hold it down it shows you what it sounds like big deep kick sound. Now here we have one beat, a little separator right here if you see the white line, another beat, a third beat, and a fourth beat where we can place our sounds. The kick likes to have a nice strong sound on the first beat and maybe the, on the start of the second beat and the third beat and the fourth beat. Let's see how that sounds. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Now the next sound we're going to hear is called the snare drum. It has a high, sharp sound. It likes to go on the off beats, not beat one, but beat two, and not beat three, but beat four. Let's see how that sounds. Cool. Now you can end up doing this whatever way you like. You can mess around with how it sounds. Notice we have two sounds in one beat. Instead of just one sound in the beat, we have two sounds in the beat. Boom, boom. One and. Three and. What other sounds are there? Let's figure it out. Hi-hat. I hat is a closed metal uh, clappers, and they have a uh, sizzly sound. Watch as I click and drag my cursor and fill up all the hi hats. Let's see how that sounds. Mm, cool. Be careful where you place certain rhythms. There's other sounds like the crash cymbal. The crash symbol is loud and can mess everything up. If we were seasoning food, too much symbols would be like too much salt, pepper, and spices. Blech! Instead of using too much, we use just enough for taste. I'm going to place a crash symbol at the beginning, and that's all I'm going to put it there. You might like to have a little bit more, but that's according to your taste. So there's more sounds to experiment with on the drum set and there's more options to explore but for now this will conclude our tutorial there's one last step your assignment is to turn this in whatever you decide to create you're gonna turn it into me the way you share it is by clicking the page button going to the fourth option share as link you're gonna link me up now it's gonna pop up your link on the website so you can travel to this link and oops you can travel to that link and I can travel to it too and I'll be able to see what you did for your homework so um, I'll show you what you need to be able to do you need to select all of this text click it and highlight everything don't leave any of the letters out I want to see everything and then you're gonna click 
a combination of two buttons on your keyboard. You're going to click Control and C to copy it. Control and C at the same time. That will copy the link. That will copy the link. Then what you're going to do is you're going to either type it in the chat to me or you're going to go to your Google Classroom page. You're going to go to Google Classroom or Seesaw wherever you just wherever your assignment is and you're going to share it with me in your assignment page. So for example, I'm going to go to my test net where nobody is but me and I'm going to imagine this is your assignment page. You would share with me on your homework and you would use this to type your answers and you would use a combination of control and V. Control V. Oops. Try that again. Control and V. That will paste the link. Um, the link we want Why isn't this copying? Control C. Control V. Ah, there it is. Control C copies it and Control V pastes. Another difference. Once you paste this in your homework page for the assignment, I can click it and it takes us to the web page. And I'll give you your grade for your assignment. I hope this tutorial helped you, boys and girls, and I look forward to hearing all of your great, unique rhythms that you create. Happy composing!